welcome back to my channel hope you're all doing fine so in today's video I'm going to show you guys how to do a bantu knot on your short natural hair with extensions so I'm going to be using Mali hair because I've actually done a bantu knot video in the past but it's with my natural short hair so I just decided to try to do it with this extension because I saw some videos on YouTube and I really liked it I'm like okay I'm definitely going to show it to you guys so I hope you guys enjoy this video it's so easy go like it's so fast to make this hair like it doesn't take any time and it doesn't take much effort trust me and it's really worth it you know it's really cute and it's unique because when you wear something like this and you go out you look different so I'm really loving the way it turned out and I hope you guys enjoy this video. Please don't forget to support me by liking this video and please subscribe to my channel and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye. So guys, I'm going to be starting on a clean dry hair. First of all, I'm going to apply this particular hair cream. It helps to grow out my edges. And after that, I'll be applying this soft for 8 hair cream on my hair. Then I'll apply a little bit of this dark air cream on my hair too. I just want my hair to be moisturized. And then I'm going to comb it through. Now I'm going to go ahead and divide my hair into sections. So after dividing it, I divided it into about 15 sections. So after dividing it, I'm going to go ahead and show you guys the Mali hair. This is the Mali braiding hair I'll be using. So I'm going to take two strands from the Mali braiding hair. Put it together and prepare it for braiding. Now I'm applying Echo Styler Gel on my edges just to lay them properly. So you guys are going to see how I braid my hair with the extension. I just divide my hair into three, then I place the extension on the three hair that I divided and then I start to braid. I'll just leave you guys to wash and see for yourself. So with the braiding, I'm not going to braid it to the end because I'm going to twist it later on. So guys, I've finished braiding it, now I'm going to go ahead and twist it backwards. Then 
then I'll start to fold the hair backwards and as I fold it I twist it there are so many ways to do this bantu knot so this is how I like doing mine So this is what I'm going to be doing all around. So now I'm going to lay my edges with my Echo Styler Gel. And yes guys, this is the final look. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.